Hello, and welcome back to the Lillian Link podcast. I'm Lillian Cotter. By creating content for LinkedIn, you are going to be able to take advantage of an existing opportunity. So how exactly should you take advantage of that opportunity? What are the ways to create content? How do you make sure you're not those examples of people that you see who you feel are maybe not doing it right? There are a lot of incredibly powerful tools when it comes to making your LinkedIn work for you. All of those hows, all of those whats um, will be things that we will cover in future episodes. Uh, We're going to keep these episodes really bite-sized so that we can focus on just a couple of things. What on earth is content? I talk about that a lot. I use the word content all of the time to mean a lot of different things. And that is because content is a very overarching term. You know you need to be doing something with your LinkedIn. You don't have a ton of time. You know there's an endless amount of effort you could put in, but you wanna just get those quick hits. It's one of the most common questions that I get asked. What is the point of being on LinkedIn? Why should I be spending more time on LinkedIn? And what that is doing is it's creating an opportunity. LinkedIn is a platform that is growing really quickly. People are choosing to spend more and more of their time on that platform. However, it is not keeping pace. That growth is not keeping pace with the demand for content, with the actual content that is being produced. So by creating content for LinkedIn, you are going to be able to take advantage of an existing opportunity. I will be continuing to talk about all different ways to make LinkedIn work for you.